732 here at Big 550 KTRS. Time to go inside the numbers, yes. the Super Bowl numbers, to bring you, Kelly Jackson, the news of the day. Okay. How's this for a stat? Since 2001, the, the New England Patriots have run .25 quarterback sneaks on average each game. So they've run a half of a quarterback sneak each game, which is about one every other week, making that the biggest percentage in the NFL. That means they do more zero quarterback. To me. They do more quarterback sneaks than anybody else. Okay, should I act like surprised? No, I thought it was kind of interesting. All right, <laughs> never mind. I guess that was a bad number. It's a sport. I don't know what you're talking about. That was a clunker. How about this? Twenty five percent of Americans believe God plays a role in the outcome of sporting events. <laughs> Moreover, really? 50% of all Americans think that the God rewards athletes who believe and have faith. That's interesting. Um, this is mm. bad news because I think the New England mm. Patriots are the work of Satan. Oh, gosh. Here we go. So there you go. <laughs> I don't know about that. Uh, how about this? In the NFL... There were 20, well, let's round it up, 30% more penalties called in the NFL regular season than the playoffs. 30% more penalties in the regular season than the playoffs. Okay. Uh, and finally, Kelly Jackson, according to Bloomberg, the government seized $1.38 billion of counterfeit goods last year. It's a law enforcement mission, Operation Team Player, to cut down on fake sporting equipment and sporting T-shirts and hats and mugs. Wait, that was just in sporting stuff? In sporting what? attire. Jeez. $1.38 I thought you were talking like counterfeit purses and stuff. No, that wow. is way more. That is. Yes, that's way more important, yes. too, because who's walking around with a fake Louie? That's unacceptable. <laughs> 734, those are numbers inside the news. Big 550, KTRS.